Hey guys, it's the Mayhem Minute for March 13th, 2015, Friday the 13th. And uh, today we have a little Lucha Underground news as I'm reading over at WrestleZone uh, about uh, both Rey Mysterio and Alberto El Patron, former Alberto Del Rio, uh, have uh, deals with Lucha Underground, according to this, uh, which will see the two former stars uh, tied into, quote, the company if the promotion really takes off. So what kind of weird uh, uh, circumstantial deal is that? Um, they also say as far as Lucha Underground's performance, it could be seen. It could soon become the number two promotion in the United States. I think Impact has taken a giant dive after they've gone to Destination X, of course, or Destination X, Destination America. Um, they've been in negotiations to be upgraded from Unimas Channel to Univision, Unimas, uh, which where uh, they they actually are broadcast in Spanish on there. Some of you guys get the on demand in Spanish only. Uh, I've noticed on on Verizon, Comcast, something like that. I've I've heard uh, from the guys. Um, I have not kept up with the lucha Angra. i have kind of but i have kept up with the conversation with our friends doing the midweek war podcast um here on wrestling mayhem show.com and i'm very excited for it i really i when i'm done with this wrestlemania experiment i'm going back and i want to watch up until this point um because it's nice because it is a storyline is it doesn't seem like something i want to just drop in like it seems like a series i want to follow like other television um but uh, this with, uh, you know, Alberto and Rey Mysterio, I think it'd be fantastic for them and see them picking up so much steam. Um, they're not a typical indie. You're, I don't think you're going to see live shows of Lucha Underground in the same manner, maybe eventually. But even uh, from discussion with somebody that was uh, trying to get tickets uh, in, and I, I, I'm thinking you can't even buy tickets. I'll have to double check with that. But I, I feel like it's a kind of a studio audience daily show free ticket giveaway kind of thing. Um, but that may soon change if people keep wanting to get involved in it. Um, you never know. Or it becomes more of a lottery or something, maybe much like uh, I think daily shows become with its popularity. Um, um, but, uh, you know, still, it, it, it's uh, really tremendous to see Lucha Underground kind of growing in this fashion um, and uh, it, it, and really kind of the surprise out of left field. And I think that's something that we've been discussing for a while is Lucha Underground is uh, or we've had room for kind of somebody to take the idea of wrestling uh, on a show and kind of turn it on its head a little bit. I know we've we've uh, 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 trumped up the the idea of what Chikara does as a wrestling alternative on the indies, but they've never been able to do something on a level like this. And yeah, it's the L Ray Network. Do you know what it is? You will soon. Um, but it's still something on a significant level, doing something with enough production value that uh, that people are going to take notice, and people are taking notice, and and the writing and everything is compelling enough that uh, that people are really really getting into this, and it's attracting names like Rey Mysterio and uh, and uh, Alberto Del Rio, um, and, and make no mistake, you know, some of that news there about Univision and everything, you know, this is a very Spanish centric uh, thing, and 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 that is a huge 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 market and ever growing here in the united states um and very exportable uh, as well maybe to to mexican stations and everything um i think they're doing a tremendous thing with you know presumably little resources you know i don't think it takes that much to do what they do here um they got they have a studio set they're doing they're just being creative and I think that's tremendous. Um, so what do you think about the growth and the rise of Lucha Underground? Is it going to be solidly the number two wrestling promotion here in the United States? What is your order of wrestling promotions when we talk about them? When we talk about, obviously, WWE up top, you know, um, uh, going to Lucha Underground, uh, uh, Impact Wrestling, and, uh, of course, Ring of Honor with being the other televised wrestling at this point. Uh, what is your order of, of, of importance? You know, what do you think is the top? one and you can say about you know financially or whatever but even just interest you know what what are your top your top in there uh let us know on the comments to this or on uh twitter at mayhem show uh facebook for wrestling mayhem show and wrestling mayhem for this and other shows you can subscribe directly to on itunes youtube and the like we'll see you next time this show is a member of the sorgatron media podcast network Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.